Hey everybody. We just got back from our cabin in Southeast Oregon. We always go over there in the winter time to kind of check on things and try to spend a little bit of time. Uh, we also went over to get the obsidian rocks that we have over there. And um, so I'm going to show you uh, a few just pictures from around the area. The sunset was amazing. And I mean, we always have these beautiful sunsets there. Um, this time they, you know, it, it didn't let us down. They were great. So I took some pictures. Some I just actually snapped right out the window. Um, but anyway, and then at the end after that, I'll show you the obsidian rocks and uh, maybe talk about what we plan to do with them. So this is maybe about, um, oh, a third of the rocks that we brought back. These are all obsidian. Um, a lot of you would look at this if you're not familiar with obsidian and say, really? You know, it just looks like a gray rock. Um, one good way of telling is you see these little like fingernail indentations. It's kind of the same with agate. Agate is that way too. Um, a lot of times you'll see these little fingernail type indentations in it. I hope you can see that. Um, when you spray this, you can really begin to see it. There's a sheen in there, but the best way to tell, of course, now you look at this one, is where it's broke. This just looks like a rock on the outside, but when you break a piece away, there it is. It's beautiful obsidian under there. Um, so we found a lot of these big ones. I mean, these are pretty good size. Of course, you can find obsidian a lot bigger than this. Um, we found these in uh, Lake County, uh, southwestern Oregon. Here's one that was already, it was broke pretty much all around it. Uh, not, it has some of the natural uh, on the back side, that outer crust. And you can see the beautiful sheen there. And we did find uh, one obsidian, I mean, uh, not obsidian, mahogany, mahogany uh, obsidian. Those are always pretty to find. We have one piece and I didn't bring it back that's, oh, you know, it's pretty good size. It's about like that. And it's got a, a chunk broke out of it. And it is the rainbow obsidian, really pretty too. Here's another one. You look at the back side. Okay, just looks like a rock. There it is when it's broke. That's a nice example there. Uh, we did find one pretty piece of uh, jasper over there too. That was pretty. So anyway, I think our plan for a lot of these, now some of these are really big. We do have a 12 pound tumbler. Now we've never tumbled obsidian before. But we want to. We want to try to tumble some of this. Now, I've got several. I've got like a grocery bag full of about this size. And um, these should be kind of fun to do. You know, some of the smaller ones. We might try to do a few of the bigger ones and see how they turn out. 
And my plan is to try to, uh, I'm, not, I'm not sure what this was, but I thought it was pretty. I'll show you. Um, our plan was to try to uh, video all of it from, you know, beginning to end so that you'll kind of be able to see the steps in the process. And then I'll put a video out. Of course, I'll put the video out when it's all done. So, you know, we're probably looking at a couple of months before I'll actually put a video out on these. But um, anyway, lots of lots of beautiful obsidian here. Um, we don't have anything to slab. A person might want to slab some of these. Um, there's just all kinds of things that you could do with them. I'm just really curious right now how they're going to polish. And like I said, this is maybe a third of what we have. So we have a lot that we can kind of experiment with as well. There's another one that's already broke. The backside with the crust. And then without it. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you enjoyed that beautiful sunset. And uh, if you like this kind of thing, remember to subscribe. We rock hound, e-bike, camp, RV, metal detect, uh, all kinds of Dutch oven cooking. I love to do Dutch oven cooking. Um, give us a thumbs up. Share it if you want. And until next time, we'll be keeping life simple.